Pakistan. She's been uh, sentenced to death for cheating on her husband, and uh, and this, was, this happened about two years ago. And then um, Amnesty International, a bunch of different governments in the world came out and spoke out about how this is ridiculous, right? And so she's still alive today, but she's in prison. Um, but the first thing they do when a woman is accused of this, not a man, by the way, um, is they whip them 99 times. And if you can imagine getting hit with a whip just once is insane, um, for any reason. <laughs> um, 99 times for ch supposedly cheating on your husband, right? She claims her innocence on this. But even if she did, it's just ridiculous. And this still goes on in different corners of the world. And we in the Western world like pointing fingers over there and saying, look at those evil Muslims, the way they treat their people and stuff. But Christians were doing the same thing just a couple hundred years ago. We were just as insane. So uh, it's, it's the fact that Islam started about 500 years after Christianity. There's still a learning curve, right? So these people will catch up eventually. But if, the, if we point fingers at them and say, there goes the bad people, it's not gonna help at all. We really need to just kind of lead by example. And in America, I'm, I'm sad to say that uh, leading by example is what child pageants. We have little kids dressed up as strippers mm -hmm. in, in game shows so they can win prizes. Um, that's not leading by example, by the way. That makes people wanna cover up their women even more, so. Um, anyway, so this is a song about, uh, sung from the point of view of the person who holds the whip, because oftentimes uh, it's easy for us to point fingers at bad people, but not at the dark side of our own soul. So I wanted to write a song about the dark side of my own uh, thinking. And it's just about uh, political prisoners all around the world, I guess, that are still behind bars because they stood up for what is right. And, uh, so that's that. Hmm. It's a very happy Christmas song. <laughs>